welcome back to my channel. My name is Meredith and I make a video every single Monday about oh. homemaking. So cooking, cleaning, and how I take care, which I need to do over there, and how I take care of my family of five. On this week's video, I'm doing a pap, pap? pack and prep with me. So we are going to Pennsylvania for Thanksgiving where my family lives. We currently live in Florida, so we are driving because we're not comfortable flying um, with my oldest yet. He's had a lot of surgery, so we're not comfortable with that. So we're driving from Florida all the way up to Pennsylvania as a family of five, and we're gonna take my Suburban. So oh, I don't know why I'm out of breath doing this, but I'm gonna take you along the journey of what I have done to just prep for this, to make sure everybody has clothing. Because again, we live in Florida, so we don't really need any of these clothes or winter jackets or boots. I have to go through and figure out what fits, what doesn't fit. So if you'd like to keep watching. Oh, my husband took our kids on a golf cart ride for a few minutes. A few moments of silence and stillness in this house, which is great. Um, tomorrow is the Tennessee Georgia game. Go Vols. I hope they win so bad. Okay, so we are packing. We're going to Pennsylvania for Thanksgiving break to visit my family, and I'm so excited. So here's kind of, oh my gosh, it's just... We're in a rental house and there's, we had to downsize. So there's like, of course, enough space for everything, but that's fine. I'm going through stuff because we currently live in Florida. So we are in like flip flops and t-shirts and stuff all of the time. So I had to pull out all of our winter stuff and figure out, I mean, like winter coats. We don't need any of that here. So I'm going through and just organizing. Um, we're a family of five and our three kids are seven, five and two and a half. So I'm going through and doing like Thanksgiving day. I have all three of the kids out and then I'll add like underwear and socks and stuff like that. And then I'm kind of doing the Wednesday before Thanksgiving, kind of another little Thanksgiving themed outfits. So I'm laying them out. So I have enough outfits for all the kids for the whole week. Um, because the first part of the week, we're going to Hershey, Pennsylvania to go to Hershey's chocolate world, which will be so fun. And then so excited for that for the kids. Um, this is my oldest. I'm just like putting outfits together. So this is everyone's outfit. So Wednesday, Thursday, and I'll make this the travel day. So when we get to my um, dad's house, they obviously have like a washer and dryer so I can wash some stuff. But I'm just going through and seeing what fits, what doesn't fit, and what I still need to Once buy. Once I go through everything, I'll lay out all of my outfits. And then what I'm going to do is we are going to take my Suburban, which will be amazing if we take my husband's truck like we do on certain trips i can't really take suitcases because they don't fit in the back as well um, and we use just like plastic totes for that so i think i'm going to take my two hot pink um i fly luggage and then we have two black duffel bags i'm going to try to pack everything into that so i will lay out everybody's outfit and actually what i might do um is use ziploc bags like i used to and put like literally like Tucker Thursday and put everything in there for that hurts holding the phone like this, but the lighting is just on point. Don't mind everything back here. So what I'm going to do is I'll pack for like the first half of our trip, which we're going to be driving from Florida all the way up to Pennsylvania. No, thank you. But I'm really excited to see my family and we're really excited to take the kids to Hershey, Pennsylvania to see Hershey's chocolate world. My husband has been before when he was little and loved it. So I'll pack like four days worth of, st worth of stuff in a bag. And then I'll do like from all the Thanksgiving outfits um, and those outfits in a separate one and just leave that in the vehicle because we probably won't need that. So, is that Tinley's? Oh yeah, it has a matching top. These are so cute. This is the Easy Peasy line at Walmart. Oh my gosh, look at this cute little outfit. We are going up to Pittsburgh to visit my family. We live in Florida now, so we are always on like shorts. Flip flops, so I gotta get everybody more winter clothing. So it's been... He's still sleeping. Okay. Easy peasy. And I have a two and a half year old, a five year old, and then a seven year old. This is so soft. It's pretty good. Yeah, 2T on this. So we'll see. He's like tall and skinny. So he's like in a 18 to 24 month, but let's see what else we got. It was also my sister Katie's 18th birthday. So what we did is I had the kids and I, we just picked out 18 gifts for her to open. I just thought that would be super fun. And we mainly just got her like toiletry items, travel items, um, lip glosses, hair masks, face masks, stuff like that, that she can keep in her car and her purse. And then when she will travel back and forth 
um, to college when she goes to college next year. We also got her that super cute, did you see that little pink pinata that we filled with pink Starburst? Okay, now moving on to my car, I have a uh, Chevy Suburban, I think it's a 2016, so this is kind of what the model looks like. I stocked us up with snacks. We have, um, well, it's one DVD player that I can put in DVDs, and then there's two DVDs like up there on the top. So like the middle row can see the movie and the very back row can see the same movie. So what I try to do is I have snacks and activities that they can do. And then the next thing we'll do during the trip is put in a movie on the DVD player. And then after they like can't stand that anymore, then we do iPads as like the very last resort. Because during a long trip, you don't want the iPad to die within like the first two hours. So I got the car washed, I vacuumed it out, deep cleaned everything. I went over all of our suitcases because this trip was really exhausting. I'm not gonna lie, but I was so excited to see my family, but it was very, very hard and difficult for us to travel all the way from Florida up to Pennsylvania. It's 16 hours one way with like no traffic. You know, it's, it's just very, very hard. And we were going to different locations. So we went up to Hershey, Pennsylvania first to see my sister play in her state volleyball game. And then we stayed at Hershey Camping Resort. And then we drove to Pittsburgh to stay with my family. Then halfway back, we stayed in North Carolina to see my sister just for one night. So I had to make sure when I was packing that I had certain suitcases for certain times because we ended up, you know, staying at five different places, including hotels. So what do y'all think? How do you think I did? <laughs> That's pretty much all the tips and tricks and what my suburban looked like at the very end, traveling as a family of five, stopping at many different places, staying in hotels, but we did it. We made it happen and we survived. So much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and like this video and I will see y'all next Monday. Bye.